So a little free library is a concept where it's take a book, leave a book. People can put them in their yards or neighborhoods and fill them up with giveaway books and anyone is welcome to come and shop their little free library, maybe leave one that they really like or enjoyed for the next person. So I had a Klamath County resident call me and say that she was concerned that there were some kids that didn't have access to books in her neighborhood. And so her and I talked and we kind of thought it would be a great idea to kind of sort of do this contest where people would get really inspired about little free libraries in their neighborhoods. And we wanted to do something to spend some time this summer together to work on a project. So this is the project that we chose. We have a big garden area that we're going to be putting it next to. We grow a lot of sunflowers and we thought it would be it would kind of mix in with our garden theme as well as uh, just kind of reminds us of, of Oregon and Klamath Falls. I don't have an idea of what books are going to be put in it, but I know where it's going to be. We're going to put it in back behind our fence after our like big huge garden area for people who are going across the street. And it'll be near, it's up on uh, Birch Avenue near the bike path. So we think it'll get some traffic of people who are taking their animals and stuff down to walk on the bike path and walk past our uh, back property quite a bit. We knew we wanted to build a little library friends contest and that Annika really pushed the um, the rest of the group to say yes we can do it because we have not really built anything like this um, so her enthusiasm um, really carried us through and so we went to the um, Unitarian Universalist um, to get some help both with manpower and tools because we did not have either <laughs> and um, I am really partial to um, stained glass both regular and mosaics so I said well here's here's something I can really contribute um, and we kind of decided on um, a uh, animal theme. This happened to be owls, so it was kind of like what would be um, cute and graphic that we, that I could do in stained glass relatively short. There were a lot of mistakes and frustration in the woodworking component, mostly on the parts that I was helping with. <laughs> when we got together, and, uh, especially Anya asked, well, "What do you want?" I said. I, I don't know, a box, you know, but well, what do you want it to look like? And I said, cute, I guess, as I just bought myself a house, a little house. And uh, so she said, okay, we'll do cute cottage. I said, fine, whatever you want to do, it's wonderful. And it came out so wonderful. I have nothing to do with this decorating and painting. She did all of it. It's wonderful. I love this library, um, and I love how creative they are in getting people to come in and participate. Um, it just makes me really proud of our library in Klamath Falls, and then that they found a way to bring people in and participate, but also a way that also then goes back out and makes our community better by having these three little libraries throughout uh, Klamath Falls is such an amazing and smart way to do um, a program. <laughs>